two poems, the first of which takes place, or doesn't take place, but mentions this tree that we're sitting under. It's called Don't, Don't Burn Again for Nothing. It's for Gerald Stern. I would make you a promise that the world will turn toward good, but you're no fool to the way worlds turn, and you know my powers and promises often fall short. Don't burn, love. There's a small grove of wax myrtle and cedar. Its shade is honey when the sun is high and hot. Bees gather there to rest. If you burn, I'll try to soothe you with oils, aloe, and lotion. What's this all about, you ask? I don't know. I don't know. And another with another title stolen from a better writer. Love is not a victory march. It's come to this. Freezing night, a quarter moon in the sky, one star bright as the spaceship hovering in the south, somewhere over the water. It was too cold to sing. We walked. Particulates, dust, pollen, floated in my headlamp's bright beam. Fluorescent bugs glowed like jewels in the grass. Love, how far away it is. Googled, it's a village at the edge of a lake, satellite image dark and round, with what could be trees ringing the shore from heart to heart as the crow flies. Who can fly with crows, love?